Warning. All stunts performed in this video were conducted in a safe and controlled environment by trained professionals. What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video, man. And today we're going to be reviewing the Pro Mag Drum Magazine compatible with the Glock 43X and Glock 48. So you know, the 10 round standard mag, not enough. Had to drop that out. Well, I recently did a review on the ETS 19 round magazine, so make sure y'all check that out. Hey, that thing clean, but we still need some more rounds, you feel me? So boom, today we're gonna be upgrading you know, pro mags, a lot of people like to talk about them. But today, we're going to be putting it to the real test. So, first things first, we're just going to open it up, see how it loads, and see how it fits inside that 43X. So, we'll take that off. We don't need is that, my boy. Boom. Let's see just how it fits real quick. Nice. Perfect. Like, looks real clean. I actually really like this a lot. Of course you're gonna like any drum on a handgun, like it just looks wild. But we also got the RWB mag for the 19X. So let's go ahead and drop this off. Now I got the twins. I got lightning and thunder. Oh my god. Bro, y'all know I gotta make a video with my 19X and my 43X with the both dual drums. That video is gonna be a banger, so stay tuned for that. But hey, that's not what the point of the video is. The point of the video is to review just this Pro Mag on the Glock 43X. So it fits perfect, nice, not coming out, feels really good. The all black looks solid. All right, so it passed the look test, but let's see if it passed the loading test. I like this better actually, the Pro Mag, how you can just twist it with your hand. The RWB mag that fits with the 19X, it has a little switch lever, but the lever broke off because it's real cheap plastic. So now I'm over here trying to turn it and I'm like breaking my fingers trying to grip it. But you feel me, them Pro Mags, they already know what it is, man. You got that nice dial, get the good spin. So now I gotta grab some ammunition. All right, so I'm gonna be loading up with some Blazer Brass 115 grain. All right, y'all, so I put the whole 50 rounds inside the pro mag drum i got my 43x right here i'm about to take it to the range and we're gonna see if this thing jam up or not So, what did we learn from this video? We learned that the Pro Mag drums are overhated. You feel me? They might not be the most reliable drum, but you feel me? Any drum magazine on a handgun, you probably gonna jam once with any magazine. I mean, the, um, the only problem I had with it, the other clip, 
not the one where I dumped it, but the one where I slowed it down. The last shell got caught in the um, chamber, but it ran 50 rounds through. If that would have happened while it was cycling, then it would have been a problem. But since it was the last round, I won't trip in. My RWB mag, the tan one, never jammed up on my 19X. So, you know, the Pro Mag right now is getting a solid 8 out of 10 for me. Like, I feel like I dumped the 50 round magazine pretty accurately. I don't know, y'all. Let me know. Do y'all think I saved her or not? I think she's safe, you feel me? If somebody was held hostage at gunpoint and I had that 43X with the Pro Mag, y'all, y'all gonna make it out safe. And you know, you coming home to see your family, you feel me? I might join the military or something, they need that. Look at that grouping, bro, like, she most definitely getting out of there. Do that fry like bacon, you feel me? Look at that, twice in the shoulder, and I think I hit him, where else I hit him? I hit, oh no, that's her arm, I'm tweaking. I accidentally hit her arm a couple times, but she'll be all right though. It looks clean. It got the nice grip on there to load it. Loading it isn't that hard. It's just really annoying. Like the first 30 rounds goes in clean, but after that, you gotta sit here and twist it. Overall, I do like this Pro Mag. I wouldn't put my life on the line with a Pro Mag. I did order a um, Shield Arms 15 round magazine that fits flush with my 43X. So this is the standard mag, hold 10 rounds. I got another magazine coming in soon that hold 15 and it sit flush. So I'm gonna review that soon. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about this mag down below in the comments. Let me know what other stuff y'all wanna see me review. I'm about to cop another handgun, my first 40 cal. I'm not copping a Glock. So if y'all know what it is, comment down below. Y'all take a guess down below what I'm finna cop. I appreciate y'all. Hey, everybody subscribe on this video. We about to hit 300K. I appreciate y'all for watching. I'm going to catch y'all on my next video, man. Wait, wait, wait. Hear me out. Hear me out. All right, so boom. This is what I was thinking, right? My first shot, you can see right there, I shot his gun, right? So this is just a portrait. This is not a live, real-life situation. So my first shot hit his gun. When I shot him in the gun, he was like, ah, and he moved over. When he moved over, she dove down and that means that he was standing right here so that means that all these shots it looks like it hit her but really he took a step to the left and she dropped down so all this is face shots and all this is his chest you feel me that's why i'm, I'm giving him face shots right here he stepped over all this is in his chest assist look at that grouping bro that's like five shots in a row that's like three shots in between the eyes one two three might be four I don't even know. I mean, not in between the eye. In between his chest, it says.